Assalamu alaikum, peace be upon you. My name is Kenny Bomer, and this is video four in the video series on the rights of women in Islam. One of the greatest misconceptions about women in Islam is that they are somehow oppressed by being forced to wear the hijab or oppressed by being forced to cover themselves in modesty. But that is not at all the case. Although highly recommended for women to wear hijab, recommended by Allah, our God, our Creator Himself, it's a woman's choice, just like it's a man's choice whether or not he carries himself in modesty. To observe the hijab, which is a form of modesty, Muslim women are required to modestly cover their bodies with clothes that do not reveal their figure in front of non-closely related males. However, the hijab is not just about outer appearances. It's also about noble speech, modesty in all aspects, and dignified conduct. There are many benefits of the hijab. And once again, the key reason Muslim women observe the hijab and dressing modestly is because it's a command from Allah, our God, our Creator, and He knows what's best for His creation. The hijab empowers a woman by emphasizing her inner spiritual beauty rather than her superficial appearance. It gives women the freedom to be active members of society while maintaining their modesty and dignity. The hijab does not symbolize suppression, oppression, or silence. Rather, it's a guard against degrading remarks, unwanted advances, and unfair discrimination. And in the non-Muslim world, women are exploited for their physical appearance. And it's believed that a woman is liberated if she has the right to show off as much of her body as she wishes. But if she chooses to cover herself in modesty, she's somehow oppressed. So the next time you see a Muslim woman, know that she covers her physical appearance by choice as a form of worship to our Creator. She is not covering up her mind nor her intellect. So again, my name is Kenny Bomer, and this is video four in the video series on the rights of women in Islam. And if you'd like more information about women in Islam, it can be obtained by contacting your local mosque or the Islamic Center in your area, or by contacting Discover Islam at P.O. Box 650022 in Sterling, Virginia. And of course, you can continue to tune in to the video series on the rights of women in Islam on this channel. I leave you by saying, Assalamu alaikum, peace be upon you, and thank you for listening. What? <laughs>